Today we're in a town which claims to have the best weather in Europe. We are in Torox, Costa del Sol, a popular town for beautiful beaches and a huge German community. What's it like? Let's go and find out. This is Julian. Hi, this is Aslan. After living in London for 18 years, we dropped our corporate lives to move to this beautiful part of Spain, Costa del Sol. We have explored every single town of Costa del Sol from Gibraltar all the way to Neja. Now it's time to explore the last piece in the puzzle, Thorax. Every week we bring you exciting videos. Please help us by subscribing to our channel to bring you even more exciting content. Nestled in the sun-drenched shores of Costa del Sol, Torrex is a picturesque town that brings the charm of traditional Andalusian culture with the Mediterranean beauty. Known for having the best climate in Europe, this fascinating destination offers a perfect balance of history, vibrant local culture and stunning natural landscapes. The eastern coast of Malaga isn't connected by train. So hiring a car or taking a bus from Malaga coast station is the best way to get there. Also, if you are staying in the beautiful town of Nerja, Torox is only 12 minutes drive away, while just under an hour from Malaga. Torox is split in two parts, Torox Costa or the coastal part and Torox Town, only seven minutes up inland. There is a frequent bus service between the two, and taxi is an affordable option too. Torex Costa is also divided in two sections, a quieter beach with the stones, and around the lighthouse, a long, wide, sandy beach, which could easily be one of the top five beaches on Costa del Sol. Before that, we are going to take you to Torex Town, and tell you why you should consider to move here for a quiet Mediterranean life. Stay tuned. We have just arrived in Thorax and luckily there's a free car park just behind me opposite the police station. It's called Almadena. The first impressions of the town look very Spanish, but we'll go and find out and let you know how it's like. First up, we are heading to Plaza Constitución, where hundreds of umbrellas are hung in the sky to cool down the square, but also a great spot for Instagram pictures. We are in Plaza Constitución. This is the main square of Toros town. Here you will see the city hall, lots of restaurants, but also this square is very famous for having 600 umbrellas hanging here to cover you from the hot months of the summer. This year, unfortunately, the umbrellas are not on because they're doing some renovations in the square. Torex proudly boasts of having the best climate in Europe, with mild winters and warm summers. It is an ideal place to move or visit as a year-round destination. Due to that, the coast of Torex is home to a large German population, and the town is home to many nationalities. We spoke to the owner of the bar in Plaza Constitution, Gareth, who has been living here for four years, and lovely Carolina who has been on Costa del Sol for over 20 years now. They told us about all the lovely places to visit in the town and a very interesting festival which happens every December where the town people and tourists gather about 30,000 people 
to eat breadcrumbs. Imagine that. The bar in the main square is a great place to mix with locals and share stories. Even though Torres looks very Spanish town, it has a long history going all the way back to Phoenicians. And you can see from the old town center, the old narrow streets with houses built one after another on top of the hill. It also has a lot of character in here. That's what I really like about Torres. One of the, my favorite things is the tiles. Everywhere around the town, you, you can spot a few tiles, different patterns, looks gorgeous. Torox is a small town with a village feeling. When you come here, you feel like you're part of a small community. However, don't be fooled because there are a lot of facilities for you to enjoy, from bars, restaurants, shops, and also a good variety of hotels. One of the things I like about walking around the streets of Torox is its character. Aslan mentioned before about the tiles, but also you can see all around the town little drawings telling you the history of the town. Torox is not a big town. It took us about an hour to go to the end and walk around and come back here. I quite like this town because when you get to a new place, you straight away get an energy. And I'm getting quite positive vibes from this town. Like many towns on Costa del Sol, there is the town and then there is a beach town. Torox beach town is called Torox Costa. We're heading in now and to see what's the vibe like. Let's go. Torox River divides the two sides of the beach. On eastern side, you have Playa de Benoncillo, which is stony beach with very tranquil living environment, ideal for someone looking for a quiet scape. The beach carries on all the way to Nerja, with some great spots to hang out and relax without being overwhelmed by crowds. On the western side of the river, starting from the far of the Torox, is the true coast of Torox. Lively Playa Ferrara with its bustling promenades, beach bars, chiringuitos, and water sports are favorites amongst youngsters and families spending whole day on the beach. We are at Playa Torox. It's just after four o'clock, and now people are coming to the beach after enjoying a lovely siesta to enjoy the rest of the day here in this beautiful beach. I have to say, I'm a lover of beaches, and I am actually quite surprised with this one. It's very white, the sun looks quite nice, it's not very rocky, and it goes for miles and miles. And the view that you get from here is also quite beautiful. There are lots of facilities here as well. There are lots of restaurants, lots of shops, and it looks like they have some water activities as well. So, Playa Torox, 10 out of 10.
I was a bit hesitant about coming to Torox Playa, mainly because it's an hour and a half drive from Marbella. But we are so glad we did come here. The beach is fantastic, the energy is amazing. We highly recommend you spending a holiday here in Torox.